What's going on today, guys? Uh, we are back in the garage for another tool review. Uh, today in front of you, we have uh, the Snap-on uh, adjustable wrench set. It, the part number for it is FADH704. Uh, it currently goes for $379 uh, on the Snap-on website. Uh, they are made in Spain, uh, and they've been made in Spain for a while. Uh, I know some of the uh, odd and end tools are going to start uh, being made in the USA, uh, just like these. These are outsourced, um, but they are really good quality. I'll say that before uh, I get into anything else. Um, it's got a lifetime warranty as long as you are the original uh, purchaser of the tools. So you can't buy it from your buddy and then because your buddy wants you to uh, take it into your dealer because it's broken and he, you just give him a couple of dollars for it. It's not how it works. Um, you'll have to show it on your truck account that you bought it from him in order to get the warranty with it. Um, my only uh, issue uh, that I have with it is they don't make any bigger ones than this or any smaller ones. Uh, I know some sets uh, come with a four inch now, um, but they don't come uh, any bigger than the 12 inch uh, that you see here. And even with the 12 inch, the 10 inch here uh, opens up uh, almost uh, as much as the 12 inch there. Uh, there's really not a whole lot uh, difference between the two of them uh, so really the 12 inch is you know kind of worthless unless you want that extra leverage uh, you're not really going to get a whole lot um, if you're really depending on what you're working on you don't want to use these anyway um, you want to use you know a precise um, tool um, but I want to get into the blue point set now it's the um, industrial set the standard industrial set. Um, that one's nice because Blue Point has all of them. I'll do, let's see, they have the 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 15, 18, 24, and a 30 inch uh, adjustable. Uh, the 30 inch opens up to three and a quarter inches, which is a ton. Um, now, obviously, the 30 inch is going to be over twice the size uh, of this one here, so it better open up a lot more. Uh, but that's that's why it's nice uh, that Blue Point makes uh, a different different sizes. It'd be really nice uh, if Snap-on made just a few sizes above, uh, maybe you know an 18 and a 24. Uh, the Blue Point 24 opens up to uh, two inches. Um, just uh, just over two inches, and then the 18 inch blue point uh, opens up uh, uh, just just a hair uh, less, uh, about two just around two inches. So uh, now, <clears throat> Snap-on does make uh, a wide mouth. Uh, I believe it's an eight inch handle wide mouth, um, and that one opens up to two inches. So. Uh, the 12 inch uh, actually doesn't even open up to two inches. It's one and um, uh, one and five sixteenths. Uh, so the wide mouth uh, opens up uh, to two inches. So really, um, unless you really want the set, because the set does look really good, um, I wouldn't even get the set. Uh, I would probably just get an eight inch, maybe a smaller one, and then the wide mouth. Um, one uh, the wide mouth one I don't have the part number for it uh, but just the wide mouth uh, tool itself is hundred twenty eight dollars and fifty cents so that one's a that one's a pretty penny um, but in my opinion these are really great uh, these are nice and shiny because these are for my stationary toolbox I do have a, another set uh, that I have uh, in my rolling toolbox that are a lot dirtier um, but they are a great tool. Um, there's not a lot of slippage 
uh, in them. As you can see, they've got the teeth in there, um, so you so you can get a max force uh, grip on those, and uh, they all have them like that. Uh, but my personal opinion, uh, it, it's it's probably a toss up. If you use uh, these like in an industrial site all the time. And I mean, every day, multiple times a day, and you really want a good set without having any issues, uh, I would definitely go ahead and go with the snap-on set here. Uh, like I said, it, it is a pretty penny at $380. Um, but if you are a once a week or even a once a day kind of guy, um, I would probably just choose something a little bit cheaper. Um, but like I said, I went ahead and splurged and I bought two of them. Uh, because I like the first set uh, so much and I might even end up getting at some point one set for the garage um, Rather than just have two at work. Uh, so like I said, they're worth it if you use them all the time like I do uh, Other than that uh, go with something maybe a little bit cheaper uh, Milwaukee or DeWalt or uh, Stanley or something like that um, So if you guys have any uh, questions or comments uh, on these two or on this uh, set here uh, go ahead and leave it down below. Uh, if you guys like it and you want to see some more, hit that like and subscribe button. Until next time.